Hello, everyone. My name is Mo Zulfikar, and welcome to another episode of Income Investors. With me today is John Whitefoot with another exciting income pick. If you want to read more about what John writes on a regular basis, you can head to IncomeInvestors.com. You can find the link to the website in the description below. The U.S. economy is clearly being negatively impacted by the current high interest rates, which increase the cost of financing for American consumers. We're starting to see softer economic growth, and we expect the Federal Reserve to take note. This should translate to lower interest rates on the horizon, and that would likely help drive consumer spending and economic growth. For income investors, it makes sense to consider interest rate sensitive investments like real estate investment trusts, or REITs for short, before interest rates begin to fall. A small cap REIT that's currently offering a decent risk reward opportunity is Sol Centers Inc., traded on New York Stock Exchange under symbol BFS. John? Yeah, thanks, Mo. Sol Centers is a self managed, self administered equity REIT that operates and manages 61 properties, which are predominantly located in the metropolitan Washington, D.C., Baltimore region. The REIT's real estate network comprises or is made up of 50 community and neighborhood shopping centers, along with seven mixed use properties totaling 9.8 million square feet of leasable area. And to put that number into perspective, that's equal to a little more than 170 NFL football fields. Salt Centers also owns four land and development properties. Now, as of this recording, Salt Centers is hovering just above its 50 week low of $33.48 per share and around 13.5% below its 52 week high of $41.04. Now, this represents a pretty compelling risk reward opportunity while BFS stock pays out high yield dividends. And how is this company doing financially? Well, the Salt Centers doesn't generate the kind of revenue growth that, you know, leaves you speechless, but it does deliver consistency. The company's revenues have increased actually in each of the last three years to a record high of $257.7 million in 2023. Now, the reach revenue growth is expected to continue. The sole analyst who tracks Salt Centers forecast that the company will report a small increase in revenue to $264.7 million this year, followed by an improved increase of 6.6% to $282.3 million in 2025. Now, Salt Center's bottom line shows consistent profit, highlighted by three consecutive years of diluted earnings per share growth to a five-year best of $1.73 per share in 2023. Salt Center's is expected to earn an adjusted $1.59 per diluted share in 2024, followed by $1.24 per diluted share in 2025. And what about the dividends here? Salt Center Inc.'s fund statement shows consistent generation of positive free cash flow. This is important since it uses free cash flow to pay its dividend and pay down debt. It actually paid an actual dividend for the last 32 straight years. I expect Salt Centers to continue paying a dividend, but don't necessarily expect an increase anytime soon. It currently pays a quarterly dividend of $0.59 cents per share or $2.36 on an annual basis for a current forward yield of 6.5%. Now, that yield is above the five-year average of 5.5%, but that's due right now to its current share price weakness. John, thank you so much for your insights. Salt Center stock is worth a look for higher-risk income investors who are looking for regular dividends and the opportunity to obtain above-average share price appreciation. Institutional ownership of Sol Centers Inc. is moderate with 223 institutions holding 46.7% of the REIT's outstanding shares. The top two institutional holders of BFS stock are the Vanguard Group with an 8.5% stake and BlackRock with an 8.3% stake. Insider interest in BFS stock is also significant with 48.4% of shares held by the company's insiders. That high stake incentivizes the REITs insider to deliver better business results. That's it for today, and make sure to go to IncomeInvestors.com now to get our free special report on three income stocks to own today. One of those stocks currently has a dividend yield of 12.7%. You can find the link to IncomeInvestors.com in the description below. We'll be back with more income picks soon, so stay tuned in the meantime. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Goodbye for now.